Hey guys, Steamy Bomb on here, bringing you another episode of my Pokemon Blue Nuzlocke version, part of a series of Bon Bon's Nuzlocke pilgrimage. Um, yeah, I don't know why I left it on this screen. This screen is ugly. Oh, oh, oh here's Paprika. <laughs> Isn't he wonderful? Yes. All right. Well, we'll train. I'm gonna do a separate training, a uh, video level training thingy. What am I saying? I'm gonna do a separate leveling video to train up Green Paprika and the rest of the gang. It will be half an hour long, so whatever fits in there is what we'll get to. I'm sure Misty's Pokemon are about 20 anyway, so... Um, but yeah, let's go on to Nugget Bridge. <gasps> Look who it is! Yo, Bonbon. Bon. Hey, Obi. You're still struggling along? Back here? I'm doing great. I've got a bunch of strong and smart Pokemon. Here, let me see what you call it, Bonbon. Bon. You know, they always talked about him being a, you know, a meanie beanie, but he's not really that bad. Obi wants to fight. Who have you got for me first? Pidgeotto. Wow, we're behind. We need to get Paprika up there. Ooh, maybe Nutmeg wasn't the best choice. Oh well. Let's see what you can do, Nutmeg. Ah, not bad, not bad. We can survive a couple of hits. Who will he send out next, though? That is the question. My training uh, went pretty well. Um, but I was a bit worried about Ber Bergamot, who seemed to really struggle. Uh, but I do blame the um, Spearows for that. Maybe he's about to use Abra. What Abra? Well, this thing's only going to learn te no teleport. So, um. Ooh. Maybe I shouldn't take that risk. Uh, let's send out Sage. I don't know how useful you're going to be for the rest of the battle. Obviously, once he sends out his starter, you're not going to help at all. So hopefully this will encourage him to do that. Oh, okay, yeah, he's only going to use teleport. I don't think we've seen an Abra yet. Oh, no. Is that a Pokemon we can catch up after Nugget like, Bridge? Because if that's the, the the case... Oh, boy. I do not want to have one of those on my team. It'll take forever to, for, to get up. Maybe that's not a bad thing, though. Rattata? Let's see your Rattata against my Rattata. Oh good, well he's not gonna know Hyper Fang yet, or at least he won't know Super Fang. In fact, I haven't learned Super Fang. Not that I want to. Nummy nummy num num. Dead. Squished. Ooh, leveling up there is very nice, nice. Bulbasaur, of course, here it comes. Well, we've given everyone else a chance except Ber Bergamot, so let's send you out, huh? Crush this little dino thing, plant thing. Confusion attack. Ooh, nice. Critical hit. Yay, we defeated Obi. Hey, take it easy. You won already. More money. Nom nom nom. Hey, guess what? I went to Bill's and got him to show me his rare Pokemon. That added a lot of pages to my Pokedex. After all, Bill's world famous as a Pokemaniac. He invented the Pokemon storage system on PC. Since you're using his system, go thank him. Well, I better get rolling. Smell you later. That just reminded me of, um, I think there's a point where we're gonna have to make sure we catch enough Pokemon to progress, but I'll worry about that later. We've only missed one route technically, so that's alright. Though, we, if we can't progress, we're going to have to break the rules to make sure we can. Alright, well, let's, uh, let's get to Nugget Bridge, eh? Let's take our rowdy bunch of Pokemon here. I didn't bother training Grain because laziness, and I'm hoping to rep replace them very quickly anyway. Will not be a Pokemon I plan on using, that's for sure. This is Nugget Bridge. Beat us five trainers and win a fabulous prize. Think you got what it takes? I don't know. I mean, hopefully you're no harder than my rivals, so... I don't want to do a lot of back and forth. Oh, Caterpie? Oh, Nutmeg here eats Caterpies for breakfast. Don't you, Nutmeg? Num num num. Dead. Enemy cat enemy caterpie fainted. 
Oh uh, yeah, let's leave out nutmeg. He's so tough now. I'll crush your wheels. Whoa, good stuff. I did my best, I have no regrets. I think they all end up saying that. I'm second. Now it's serious. Wait, what was it before? A child's play. I mean, I guess the guy did have bugs. Alrighty. Well, normally I like to try and do question of the day in the middle, which is why I end up doing it at the end all the time. But um, I've just thought of a great question I'd like to know. Um, yeah, so out of Pokemon Blue version, Red version, and Yellow version, what version did you play first? Let me know in the comments below. Mine was Blue, hence why I'm playing Blue now. The first game that I owned was Yellow, though. I played my brother's blue version. I traded all my Pokemon cards to him. Well, no, I gave him all my Pokemon cards. Just so I could play his blue version. And once I finished the 8th gym leader, that was it. Not even the Elite Four. The 8th gym leader. Uh, do you say what he said? Yes, you do. Like, that's madness, right? Here's number three. I won't be easy. Yeah, we'll see about that, buddy. I've got my nutmeg. Yeah, but yeah, let me know in the comments below what your first was, and any interesting stories you might have along with it. That's my interesting story. Yellow version, I don't remember too well, only that I tried to mimic exactly all the Pokemon Ash po that Ash had. Which wasn't too hard, considering. Also, I noticed uh, when I was training that uh, I have Sandshrew, and I realised red has Ekans, blue has Sandshrew. So, um, I wouldn't have even ended up with an Ekans. I mean, Sentry would have been interesting, but... Like I said, it can't... It doesn't learn any ground moves, so it's pretty useless. Too bad. Let's give Bergamot, Bergamot some action. I can't even say my own Pokemon's name right. I'm just gonna call it Burgie. Or Burger. Yeah, Burger! <laughs> that makes sense. Burger or Mott? What would you call it? Again, let me know in the comments below. <laughs> oh, stumped flat. Whoa! <laughs> I'm number four. Getting tired? I mean, tired as in I'm sleepy and I should be going to bed. Why did I decide to stay up late? I was all full of energy before and now I'm like, slowing down. The long pauses are when I'm yawning and trying not to make it obvious that I'm yawning. You can't hide that when you've got a webcam though. I am- um, I'm not using a webcam by the way for my playthroughs. I mean, aside from the fact that it means that I'd have to like, actually put on proper clothes. <laughs> um, but I just- I guess it's just how I grew up with playthroughs. They never had webcams for some reason. I don't actually know why. But yeah, have it. Oh, I'm gonna. Oh, Nidoran female? No, I'm gonna change you. Let's get Bergie out here. Yeah, so that's just the way I roll now. I only stream with a webcam because it's. That's pe how people find you. I mean, maybe it's the same with YouTube now, I don't know, but it's not the world that I grew up in. So if you don't wanna look at me, I'm not interesting. I lost two. I mean, you definitely put up a better fight than the other two. Okay, I'm number five. I'll stomp you. Wait, didn't she just say that as well, but four? Mankey? I want that. I think it's the yellow version where you can get it in the between bit between Brilliant Forest and the Elite Four stuff. I wouldn't have minded a manky though. Oof. Oh, brutal. Let's get, um, 
Let's get our newly evolved Rosemary out. Oh, yay. Oh, actually, we should give Sage a turn. Because I know we fight that last guy. Whoa, too much. Oh, okay, you say the same thing too. Yeah, anyway, before I jump into that, I didn't really show off Rosemary here. I did pause the evolution for a bit, which was great to finally catch that at the end of the last episode. But there's Rosemary all grown up. Just Sage that needs to fully evolve now. And I guess Paprika and Grain, if they come along with us. Congratulations, you beat our five con contest trainers. You just earned a fabulous prize. Thanks for the nugget. By the way, would you like to join Team Rocket? We're a group dedicated to evil using Pokemon. Wanna join? Are you sure? Come on, join us! I'm telling you to join. Okay, you need convincing. I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. So you just stand here on this bridge challenging trainers to make them join Team Rocket? I wonder if the rest of the people were, like, Team Rocket people. Alright, Sage, you've got this. I have faith in you. Yeah, also, I've realised it's possible I- Oh, no! Oh, no. No, no, definitely. No, we know, no. Why? Why did this happen? Oh, man. I hate you so much right now. Why would you do that to my poor little sage? Hope we can get to the, the Pokemon Center in time. I think we'll be fine. But I- Going back wastes more time. Just trying to learn Supersonic. No. I also chose not to learn Sleep Powder because I realized what I said in the last episode made sense. When you're capturing a Pokemon, they can get out of sleep, but they can't get out of paralysis. So Stunt Spore's a better option. Arg, you are too good. With your ability, you could become a top leader in Team Rocket. Yeah, well, I need to get my poor Sage to the Pokemon Center. Oh, how you doing, buddy? We're almost there. Oh, no. Flashbacks, flashbacks. I know we're gonna be fine, but still. But yeah, let's get Vegemite out the front. And that top grass, um, we'll, I can't, I'm sure we get Oddish. I think Red's the one that gets Bell Sprout. Um, but that's fine. Oddish is okay. Uh, Absorb is a good move. I think it knows Absorb. Let's get Vegemite up front. We'll probably train up there too, because I think it's better. Um, but then again, that Bellsprout, Bellsprout or Oddish or whatever one we encounter might know Poison Powder, which could pose a problem. I mean, Nutmeg and um, Brain will be fine, and Paprika will, will actually, no, it doesn't learn a bird food. Oh, what? I saw your feet from the grass. Hey, dude, I don't want to fight you. I'm trying to catch Pokemon here. No, oh, great, or a tatter. Oh, come on, kill it in one hit. Oh, so close. Oh, God. Hyper Fang, you're level 14. What? When did I learn Hyper Fang? I don't remember. Alright, well, I'm switching you out because... I, um, I need Vergemont fit and ready for when we fight whatever we're going to end up catching. Maybe we encounter Sandshrews up here as well. I don't think so, though. But yeah, so I'll probably have to train my team in different areas for best results. Oh, I forgot. Wrapping this won't let you move. It's very annoying. It's useful to use yourself, but annoying when it's used on you. Oh good, alright, we're free. I thought not. Wait, what? I hid because the people on the bridge scared me. Oh, well, they're all gone now. And if they're Team Rocket members, I can see why. 
Alright, what are we gonna get, guys? What are we gonna get? Here it is. I have a Caterpie. I paused there thinking, do I have a Caterpie? And I do. Well, I did. It's, it's, there we go. <laughs> it's a Butterfree now. You, oh, great. Caterpie's gonna be annoying here in terms of XP gain. Oh! It's the ugliest Pokemon. One of the ugliest Pokemon from Generation 1. Bell Sprout. Look at that thing. Well, you're gonna be my little guy. Vine Whip. Okay, that's good. That would be bad for Sage, so we won't bring Sage here. Do I attack it? Let's go, let's try. Oh, I can't look. Okay, that did nothing. Oh, great, now we're wrapped. I mean, it can't do anything else but wrap when it's wrapping, so that's fine. Ha, you missed. Alright. Pokeball, go! I'm so excited to have this thing. Yes! Goodbye, Grain. Hello, Bellsprout. A carnivorous Pokemon that traps and eats bugs. It uses its roots to f root feet to soak up needed moisture. Yes, you're going to be another problem down there and up here. Not good. Um, alright, what are we going to call you? Victory Bell, there's no V. Yeah, there's... Oh! <gasps> We're calling you vanilla, which makes no sense. Or is there, well, there's no B, Weep and Bell, there's no, a W, Wasabi. Ooh, that's tempting. Yeah, let's call you Wasabi. I like that. Wasabi. Because Weep and Bell is the second evolution. Yes. That's my justification. No, 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 you're wrong. That thing's coming with us. Brain, I love you, buddy, but I'm so sorry. I can't resist a grass type. We're gonna crush Misty with this thing. Crush her. Mwahaha. Let's heal our team before we trade Pokemon in. Yawning. Yawning while that's going on. Oh, I'm so excited to have this thing on my team. We'll have to run like crazy from Spearows, but uh, maybe it's more grass we can get to. Let's deposit grain. Sorry, buddy. Nothing against you. If we have time, we'll probably train that. And fennel. I mean, it's cliche to have a Pidgeot on the team, but it is super strong. Anyway, let's check out our little guy and then get him on the overlay. Oh, he's paralyzed. I forgot they don't heal in there. Wrap growth, fine whip. Sorry, I have another look. Okay, let's let's get uh, your sprite up here. Um, there's Bell Sprout. God, the Gen One sprites look weird. Uh, okay, where's your brain? So your Pokemon. Zubat Sprite. All right, why did I name the sprites after the Pokemon? That was a mistake. There's a little Bell Sprout. Oh, maybe you should be called Grain. Anyway, you're not. You are called Wasabi. I need to move that a little bit though. It's a little bit off center. There we go. Our new newcomer. Look at him there. Oh, so adorable. Let's heal you up. And let, let's let's take go on. Maybe I should try and look for a sand troop for it to fight. No, let's 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 move on. We've been making some good progress this episode and we're in a bit of a roll here, so let's go on. He looks so derpy down there. I mean, most of them do. The only ones who look normal are Butterfree and Nitto King. Bellsprout, though, is honestly the ugliest one. Alright, well, ooh, ball. What are you? Ooh, TM44. We're getting a lot of these. 
We got team for Thunder Wave. Oh, how useless. No. We'll never use that. We've got Bergamot. Alright, um, I don't remember if this grass is any different to that grass in the route, so I'm just not going to count it. Like, it's the same. But let's ha check it out. See if there's something that Wasabi here might be able to fight. Oh. Just a Caterpie. But yeah, I'm counting that it's the same grass. I'm pretty sure it is anyway. Pidgey. Not good. Mostly because oh, all we'd be able to use is rat as um wasabi. Whoa, hello Charlie. I'm probably not sitting in the best position for you to jump on me like that. But you'll you'll try and sit on me anyway, won't you? I see your look. Ooh. Okay, so it's pretty much just the same. Actually, while we're here, let's see how much XP you give us, Bell Sprout. Whoa, that's a lot. Alright. I just got down from Mount Moon, but I'm ready. More trainers for us to fight on our way to Bills. I'm hoping to beat them all so I can start leveling up without worry. Ooh, handy. But, even not, it doesn't matter. I'm not too worried about that stuff. Like I said before, overleveling is my thing. Which is why I have the no potion rules, which is another thing that's kind of my thing. I should really get Sage out here. Oh well. You worked hard. Thank you, dude. I'm glad you recognize that. Local trainers come here to practice. So, does that include you? Are you a local trainer? This guy has the same expression as a tentacruel. Well, at least the sprite in this generation. And I know that because I'm looking at it right now on the other screen. <laughs> Wait, what? Why did Confusion miss? Oh no, I don't know about this, guys. I don't like the idea of that thing killing Bergamot. With a Hyper Fang. Alright, it's just gonna use Tackle. That's okay, you can do that. Uh, Spiro. Yeah, if we're changing. Sage, you get out here and do some damage to this thing. Maybe I should do switch training with, um, Paprika. That might not be a bad idea, actually. It'll put a real dent in our health, though. Oh, there's that fury attack. There we go. You're decent. Actually, the real problem will probably be uh, Wasabi, so let's get Wasabi up here and give that a go. I mean, if this guy is rock Pokemon, you're going to build? First, let's fight. They seem to be roughly the same level as Wasabi, so I know we wouldn't take any real damage if he does hit us. Oh, here we go. Onyx. 17? Can you do it, Wasabi? I'm sure you can take one hit from an Onyx. Wow, that was a critical too. Oh, but you're stronger! <laughs> nice one! Excellent. Good job, Wasabi. You're something. Wasabi is. That's probably the only hit it can take though. The trail below is a shortcut to Cerulean City. Oh, really? Handy, thank you. I did not really know that, or forgot, or something. That took me to a great party on the SSN at Vermilion City. I don't want to go on the SSN! Charlie, the guinea pigs are in bed. Oh. This would have been good for Wasabi to fight, but it does have confusion, I'm pretty sure. 
So, um, in that case, Rosemary. Rosemary can finish this thing off quickly, I think. Oh, there we go. That would have... Oh, no, now Rosemary's confused. Come on, get out of it. Oh, no. This can only go badly. Why? Why does this happen to me? I'm not risking it. There goes all that XP for poor... Um... Uh... Wasabi. Or could we lose to this thing? Knowing my luck. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this is awful. I'm gonna have to go back and heal, and that's if I even survive! Sage, why is your attack power so weak? Maybe I should have fought you, Mega Punch. I'd use Leer, but is there a point? Come on. Oh, man. Alright, the only thing that can go wrong now is either another critical or confusing me. Alright, good, we're safe. We get nearly beat up by a slowpoke. Oh, that's humiliating. I'm not mad. I'm mad. What the hell? You almost beat up my entire team. On the SSN, I saw trainers from around the world. Maybe that's why you're so tough. Alright, let's take this shortcut. Heal up and then get back to it. Although we're running out of time. But we've done a lot this episode, so I'm pretty happy with that. Ooh, that was scary. That just goes to show, if you don't heal up regularly, you can end up like this. I mean, alright, so maybe... Well, no, Nutmeg would have died from that. And that's not my fault. I'm running with a party of four. One's weak to Psychic, and Sage could barely touch that Slowpoke. So bulky. That's why Pikachu would have been good. Yes, go away, Charlie. You're distracting me. Alright, let's get back to it. We'll probably fit in one more trainer battle after this. And then, when you see me next time, I'll have done a, my first leveling video for this series. For realsies this time. Um, because even if I get the main team up to where I want them to be, I can train up Grain and um, Fennel in the PC for backup. As you can see, it's very easy for things to turn wrong very quickly. That's the way a Nuzlocke is, though, and that's part of the fun. Alright, girly. Our turn to fight. Hi! My boyfriend is so cool. What? Why was there a space between boy and friend? Do you just mean, like, a friend who's a boy? Oh, it's a little Nuri Mayo. Actually, this is a good time to check to see uh, if water is super effective against this thing. That'll be... if it's super effective, that'll be bad against Misty. If it's not, uh, it's not going to help us with Lieutenant Surge, so... Uh, okay, it's just neutral, so that's okay. We know Nutmeg is an okay choice for Misty. Um, but it's not going to help us smash Surge, so... Uh, we'll be relying on Rosemary and Nutmeg still for that situation. Actually, I forgot! We've got Wasabi! Wasabi will be good. Oof, please. Don't poison me! Oh, thank heavens for that. Can we fit in one more trainer? I think we can. Unless it goes horribly wrong. I was in bad condition. Yeah, sure you were. I wish my guy was as cool as you. It's annoying because I think that guy up there is the last trainer. I'm off to see a Pokemon collector at the Cape. No, you're not. You're answering to me first, buddy boy. Oh, Jesus. Four Pokemon and level 13. Although I think Generation 1, they're all the same level for a trainer rather than split like they are in Generation 2. Pretty sure that's how it works, except for gyms. Gym leaders. Yay, poison powder. No. Alright, Wasabi, keep doing your thing, buddy. You're doing great. I think we can finish this in the next minute. 
Um, just while we're going on this battle, guys, I just want to say thank you again for watching. Uh, it means a lot for anyone who is uh, tuning into my little old Nuzlocke here. Um, it's been a blast so far. I mean, I know we're only in early days, but I am enjoying it a lot, so that's a good sign. And I hope you guys are too. Um, but yeah. We're, we're doing good here. We've got a great team with us. I'm still thrilled to pieces that we got Nutmeg. Thrilled to pieces that we got Wasabi. Uh, yeah, uh, it's been a blast. It's been a real blast. I'm nervous because I don't know if I'm going to finish it in, in before the 30 minutes is up. Alright, we're done. I'm going to close it here, guys. You know how all this ends. Uh, but thanks again for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye!